Hi, it's Shukuna007 here, and let me just turn down my volume. And welcome back to Let's Play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. What I did off camera was I just completed that uh, part that was giving me trouble. I did figure out how to use the the wing attack. I couldn't think for that for a second there. Yeah, and now we are in the abandoned mine. I wonder what we'll find here. I'm just gonna go out and switch out from my fairy to the sword. And I like that the even as you break the pieces, they still uh, the X works better for what's coming up. And the save room. Yes, we have another sub boss coming up here. But in order for us to proceed, give you a hint to what it is, and I'm already at max hearts. Let's do this. Thanks to YouTube's time limit, I can. I've been getting a lot of these parts done. Well, here it is. Severus. But Severus should be with Hades, not in Count Dracula's. No. Yeah, now you want to be careful when they start shooting like that. I'm just gonna. Hey, I'm just gonna choose. Yeah, I don't want to die. Because I don't have any more life apples. Yeah. Sorry for being so quiet during this boss, but I've taken a... Uh, I believe in a couple more hits they should be... Yeah. Wow. 4 HP left on that fight. He's definitely a hard boss. Or a hard sub boss, I would say, for me. And over here, we have a part that we can't get to yet because we need to have that. And we have some witches. Uh, where's your sister's at? Uh, that that's a reference to a book I've been reading. Uh, to a book series that I've been reading. We're just gonna jump down and... Oh, I got the rebound stone and not a big fan of that. Gremlins. Well, we all know the rules about gremlins, right? You don't feed them at night. No loud music and no bright lights. And all that is is just a teleporter room. Transport us to another part of count of the castle and resist fire. Now we're gonna go to the left now and see what's this way. More gremlins. Sword, go do your thing. You're my familiar. And we pick up the demon card. Or as I like to call it, the Oni card. Because, uh... Oni is the, uh... Japanese word for demon. Or, uh, yokai if you want to call it that, but... Let's get into... 
and another mushroom. Let's... I can't get that now on the phone. Uh, left or right? Uh, let's go to the left first. Pick up a karma coin and a combat now. I think I'm at Schwarzenegger was here. From Predator. He left his knife. And we go down. And through this door. And in here we find the catacombs. Music is eerie, left or right again. We're gonna go to the left. And we come to a save point. Just give me one second here. Have to take some more. Just took a drink of water. And we're gonna continue. And, ooh, what's this? That's a bloodstone. Now, if I remember correctly, I'm gonna equip that. It improves healing. Very good item to keep on. I would suggest having that equipped. Pass up the save point again. And now we're gonna go... A wear skeleton. <laughs> yeah, that'd be interesting. And here we have a bone. Yeah, just be careful. And one guy will always, no matter what, run away from you on those things. So. We're gonna come... We're gonna go this way first. Blood Skeleton, Monster Vial, Monster Vial. Blood Skeleton, Monster Vial. Blood. <laughs> and I get... And what do we have here? We have a Max Heart. And a life max up. And we have the... We have the Keeper of the T. Two of them. Yeah, come on. Oh yeah, that's the one thing. You don't want to get yourself thrown out of a room. There we go. Now he gives up. I I believe he gives off a lot of it experience. And we have these guys lost. They basically throw fire at you. Best to kill them before they become deadly. And here we have another guy. A disc lord. And he was protecting some treasure up here. We're gonna take care of that in just a second in that secret passage. <laughs> and we find another Max Heart. It's hiding in the jar. Ah, yes. The Ice Brand. It's an ice sword that it will actually if you I'm not really sure about the ace brand. I know it freezes if you hit. But we have to deal with the discord again. And now look I'm just gonna to lay his punches on me. And here we got more of those Probably one part I hate. Yes. Oh no. Yes. If you wait, they will go away. And that's all that's in this room, it's just a dollar. Kingdom was being cheap. Yeah, you, 
Thank you, sword. And... I believe it's this way. Okay, I'm gonna come back to that save room in just a second. Because I pick up the walk armor. Let me see what that does. Well, it increases my defense, but it decreases my intelligence. Uh, defense increases with map coverage. I'm just going to leave on my mirror. Karaz. Alright, let's continue on. Just going to save real quick. Yes, I'm going to have a habit of saving at those save points. Even though if I... Yeah, we don't want to go in there yet. So we're going to come back to that. We're going to come back to just that one part, and I'm going to go over to the other side. Yeah, they threw me out of the room, because I was close to the, uh, the door. Because to fight the, the next sub-boss, I don't have enough... For then when I get myself stocked up to my max hearts before we fight that thing. And it's a pain, I'll tell you that. Yeah, he's dead. Gravekeepers know karate. I think they've been studying under Jackie Chan. Yeah, same dilemma. So, we're going to take care of the... of me not getting thrown back out of the room by a dumb gremlin. We're going to... and I... Stop watch, like I said. It's a useless item, I hit the wrong button again. We're going to take the bottom path first, real quick. And I don't want the book. Alright, this is where I wanted to be first. Yeah, just Whoa, that's a big... Yeah, that's just a large slime. And... Yeah. Up here. Yes, now in the... Original game on the PSP... This area was all dark. You needed to use the the echo, the sonar to get through to this room to land on that switch and to turn on the lights. Because in here we're gonna get some secret treasure. Yes, my. Uh, my bad imitation of H.C. Bailey. I mean, I don't mean to... mean it to be that way. And granted, he is a good LP -er. I've checked him out. And he's one of the people that actually has inspired me to become... to doing these... Let's Plays. So, you know, I owe him and everybody else out there. 
So let's go to the left first. This time I'll... And we're just gonna kill these uh, way of skeletons. And when I did say about the part about some hidden treasure, I was right, so right through here. And we have the Spike Breaker, probably one of the best males in the game. Like, it, like the title says. The spike breaker. It allows you to break the spikes. Now, yes, I am going to keep the sword out. I know what a lot of you are probably going to be asking me. Sukune 007, you're going to keep. Are you going to keep that sword out? And yes, because it actually becomes a very powerful weapon. And, uh, let's take the... Nothing over here. And that guy is just in the corner. Oh. So... And I'm down to 80 HP. Oh. Well, yeah, I've been, I've been not careful with my HP in this video. But anyway, this is Sukune 7 signing out, and in our next video, we're going to take care of our underground sub boss here in the catacombs and finish up this and hopefully finish up some more map percentage in the uh, underground caverns up here as you can see that map area is not finished yet over there and then in the royal chapel and then we'll take on the northeast section of this castle what will we find who will, will we be able to save Richter Belmont in time? And who is controlling him? I don't know, the questions are as good as me. It, it, well, we'll find out in our next exciting episode of Let's Play Castlevania Symphony Night. Until then, everybody, take care of yourselves and have a nice day. Bye-bye.